Adjectives in Japanese are a little weird in that we put past tense on them sometimes, or we put a negative ending on them sometimes, like we would do with verbs in Japanese. In English, we don't do that. The verb determines the tense for everything in the sentence, including the adjectives. If I wanted to say a car is blue, I would just change it to was blue if I wanted to say past tense. And some Japanese adjectives work that way too. Some of them um, just work with des, but some don't. And let's get into that. Japanese have two types of adjectives. They have e adjectives and na adjectives. So to determine what an e adjective is, is not very difficult. Aoi, samui. Atsui, atitakai, suzushi, akai. As you can see, they all end with an E sound from right to left. Blue, cold, hot, warm, cool, and red. They all end with E. So they're E adjectives. If it doesn't end in E, then it's a non-adjective 99% of the time. Um, there are some exceptions to the rule. The main exceptions are things that end with an E sound, but are A on the end, like kide or bude or shitsure. Those are all non-adjectives. Very few non-adjectives actually end with na. We identified the E adjectives by looking at the end of the adjective, but with na, it's the particle that goes in between the adjective and a noun. For example, if I wanted to say the quiet child, I would say shizuka na ko. Shizuka meaning quiet, na on the particle, and ko being the noun. So let's go back to E adjectives here for a little bit. They have a box, just like we have with some verbs. So if we look at the box, the on the top, we have two columns, positive and negative, positive on the left, negative on the right. And then we have two rows, present and past. So samui is, is cold and it's an E adjective. So I would just leave it the same if it was present and positive. I might, and I could just throw a des on the end if I wanted to make it formal or leave the des off if I wanted to make it informal. Um, if I wanted to make it negative, I would drop the e from samui to samu and have kunai. If I wanted to uh, have it passed, I would drop the e from samui to samu and add kata. And finally, the same method for past negative, drop the e, add kunakata. So, we have hot, atsui. We want to say it's hot, we just say atsui. If we want to say it's not hot, we drop that e, and it becomes atsukunai. If we want to say it was hot, we drop the e, and it becomes atsukata. If we want to say it wasn't hot, we drop the e, and it becomes atsukunakata. So let's practice that. It's warm today. Kyo wa atatakai. It's not cold today. Kyo wa samu kunai It was cool yesterday. Kino wa suzush kata. Suzush kata. And finally, if we say it wasn't hot yesterday, Now, you might say, wait a minute, we left the na adjectives behind. And that is true. Because with na adjectives, all we're going to do is change the des. So, deshta for past, janai for negative, or ja arimasen, or jan, uh, janakata, or ja arimasen deshta for the past negative. 